Fill me with your sustenance. I have so many points and so few dolaires because I just upgraded most of my gear's defense level. Yatta? How are you holding that? It's just sticking out of my... Oh my god. What a horror looking at my hands during that cutscene. It looks like a cyberpunk, like, chop chopsticks mishap. What a disaster. <laughs> the chopsticks were just sticking directly out of my hand. Alright, it's been, uh, probably, probably two weeks since I last played this game. I don't know why I said probably, I just checked during the cutscene a lot, and it's been two weeks. <laughs> Let's see. That's a lot of upgrades and unlocks that mostly don't apply to my stuff. Doo -doo -doo. Got a Rathalos, an Anginath, a Baryoth, a Somnicanth, and a Zinogre. We haven't fought Hiring Zinogre yet? I barely remember what a Somnicanth is. Okay, we have fought a Baryoth before. I got my notes. But Anginath would be new. And Rathalos? Rathalos would also still be new. I don't really like Rathalos very much. I'll probably just fight these three. Just go for them. Because I think Somnicanth might even be new. I'm not really sure. It's new to me. It's hard to tell what's new to me versus what's new to the game. I didn't check my items. That's the struggle, doing a series on this game. Got your checklist of all the things to check. There are so many things happening around town. This will, be easy. will it though? Is that what it'll be? Okay, I look like I have my stuff. Webs. Don't pick those up too often. I always think it's going to start on the left and go left or right. But when you click the right stick, it starts with the thing on the right. That's one in the back. Maybe an OG Japanese thing. It, it, Samacanth is as far away as you get. Let's see. Is that Rolly Boy? Yep. He's so silly looking and also small. He's small enough that every time I see him, I think he's just a random, like, I almost said livestock. <laughs> like, endemic life, random dude just hanging around. And then he stands up and you're like, oh, it's the bear skeleton. There's a few of those in here. No. Grab every single random item. Don't know what most of them are for. You just know you'll be in a better place if you're continually grabbing them than you would be if you weren't. It is a learned behavior. Such as the part of you that compulsively picks up plastic and shit you find in Fallout 4. You're like, I don't... I don't even know why I'm doing this. It's just trash. Granted, while I don't love the obfuscation of incentive to get things, this comes up in the Zelda discussion a lot and stuff like that. God damn it, he's running away in the exact opposite direction. I could have saved so much time if, he, if I knew he was going to go that way. Uh, this game at least does more interesting things with said things than Fallout did. That was mostly just a pointless... Resource dump in a system that wasn't. No, I regret picking this guy. 
Damn it. Damn it. I remember Somnicanth now. You're annoying. I don't like you. Um, sir? Rude. Hello. Yeah, Somnicanth's really annoying. Because it's like a weird two-part boss. They have like two separate chunks of body, and the hitbox is just really weird and annoying. Hey! Unfortunate. Somebody help me! Achilles, this is no time for a nap because he's also trying to make me go take a nap. You brought this on yourself. Boom, boom, boom. Saw that one coming. There's the numbers. Beautiful. Took a while to wake up, huh? Bad news for you. That didn't hit you. Oh. Nope. What? Still hits me. It's disappointing. Oh! Didn't know about that attack. Uh-oh. That's definitely gonna hit me. <laughs> I mean, I'm not so... I'm not even sure what I was supposed to do with it if I apparently can't... Ow. If I apparently can't block it. Yep. Okay, yeah, how do you... Where do you... This seems to cover everywhere. They get away from that in time. Hey, guys, help. Wow, thanks, Patrickless. Just fucking sta spacing out there, staring into nothing instead of being helpful. That's cool. I'll take that bonus damage you take from being attacked while sleeping. Let's go. Let's a go. Uh oh. <laughs> That's not great. Does that mean he has bonus damage from monsters? That's there. Hit him with basically everything. That's nice. <laughs> oh. Ow. Ah, shit. That's bad. That's not... That seems a little unfair. It's really funny watching him crack it open on his chest like a... like a sea otter. Even though he looks nothing like a sea otter, he looks like a horrifying night banshee thing mermaid monster.
It's like the aunties from Thirsty Mermaids. A book you've all read and understand the reference from. Obviously. Ow. No. No. Ah, fuck. Dude, he just spams it everywhere. That's not good. <laughs> there you go. Hey, I got my my sharpening off in time. That's gonna be the shockwave, isn't it? That's bad. <laughs> what do you do with that one? Run really far away? Hit him hard enough to stagger him, I guess. I don't think I feel like that's not usually an option in single player. In multiplayer things get staggered more often. Ah, that was too early. Alright, the sleep spam's getting pretty annoying now. This, the needles are, on the other hand, are such a non-issue, it's almost like they don't exist. There we go. No, I wonder. to- fuck, I forgot to dodge first. Get to dodge first to make the reload work. Stone time. Just having a normal one. Hey, getting a lot of those p broken parts notifications. How you feeling, buddy? Need a rest? What's this? I can send you straight to hell. Sup? So oh. Shield up. Okay, ranged it at least. Ah, fuck, my health's already up. I'm a fool. Somebody healed me. Oh, not there yet. Just a moment. There it goes. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. Who that made me worried. Give me your healing goop. Thank you. Big numbers, big numbers. I don't have a strike. I wasn't expecting an opening that long. That's not what I meant to do. What did I just do? Ah, fuck. Ah, the healing field's gone. Whatever. Oh, because I remembered that the dodge is left trigger plus, yeah, plus B. But I pressed B, the non-Nintendo version. Somebody help. <laughs> Oh, he was stunned for so long. What are you doing there? Was that supposed to be an attack, but it, like, broke? Ow. My character's moving a lot slower each time. 
What? Why did I do that? Well, was my weapon away? Oh, it might have been away. That was the wrong move. Ah, yes. The time old tradition of fucking lying. I have so many sub camps on this map. Remember when I thought they didn't exist? Because, I mean, they are pretty small levels. I unlocked a fair number of them just trying to, uh. Do -do 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 -do. I unlocked a fair number of them just trying to, uh. Something, something, something. What was I talking about? Uh. Oh, yeah, unlock this. Get this, uh. What was I doing? I don't know. I had to hunt for some rare shit you only find in certain parts of the environment. I don't remember why anymore. <laughs> I don't remember. I'm like, that wouldn't have been for armor, right? Because you get armor by fighting monsters a bunch of time. I don't remember what my goal was. Fuck. Alright, yep. Really tired of this enemy. Get it? <laughs> Help me. <laughs> Haha, uh, you're too slow. Ah, uh, my weapon's not out. Here comes the pain. Doo 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 doo. Oh, I, I was, uh. Yeah, I was unlocking submarines. They both require you to search and scour the environment for obnoxiously rare resources. And you end up accidentally finding the uh, camps along the way. It took me a long time, actually, because, among other things, rather frustratingly, I would go to a specific spot on the map that said it had the resource I needed to get. And then I'd go pick it up, and it'd, I'd pick up a, a resource that sounds really similar. And then while I'm picking up that really similar sounding resource, the game would be like, Wow, you completed a mission! And I'm like, cool, I got it. It even said I completed it. And then I'd get back to tech camp and realize that I accidentally completed something else. And I either needed to gather another item that was near the one that I found and I was slightly wrong. Or in some cases, I would find that apparently, uh... I just have to gather the same that exact node over and over again because you give you get RNG items and it didn't happen to give me the one I needed. So I have to come back and get the same one after it respawns. So I ended up loading the same maps like two or three times sometimes, just trying to get them all. A bit uh, a bit annoying. Kind of a pain. Got it done. No. No. It looks tantalizing, like you can now pace it, but you have to be a lot closer if that's gonna work. How'd that not? Oh. Yeah, those purple spikes are pretty not a threat. Oh crap. Ooh, you're annoying. No! I don't need this yellow sharpness th shit in my life. Ah, uh, I have speed sharpening or whatever, I think. Ah, that sucks. That's what uh, hitting things does, usually. They tend to not fare as well as they would have been if you had not been hitting them. Barrr. Barrr. Hello. 
Oh, nope, not done running away. <laughs> Oh, uh, or b maybe still running away? Where is it? There it is. Yep. You just come sit your pretty ass right over here. Just right over here. There you go. Look, I've got sleeping powder too. Wow. Isn't that fun? Don't you like when people do that to you? Wow. I'm sure you'll want to do it even more now, having been on the receiving end. It's great, huh? That's enough of you. Coming around camera when she comes. Feline Chief Kogarashi. The feline who manages the Meow Snaries from Buddy Plaza. Many years ago, he served as Elder Fugan's Palico. His skills haven't dulled since, and he can best be. Uh oh. When Serpent. Uh. Which one's you? The one on the right? Yeah. Uh, when Serpent Ibushi is driving the horde from behind, your task will be to slay the beast. The villagers defending the stronghold will do their best to drive Bushi out. As usual, you'll be standing by inside. The calamity that threatens Kamara ends today. Alright, Jord, our fate is in your hands. Now get to it. I thought I had three. I thought I had like three missions to go. Hello. An urgent request has come in for you. The time has finally come to slay Wind Serpent Ibushi. Though my sister is putting on a brave face for the village deep down, she is suffering. If only I had her power, I would gladly take her place. Ugh. Why am I so... Forgive me. Jord, I beg you, please. Please save my, the, sis, the village. Save my sister. Has been I thought I had three missions left. This tier. Is it not going to be at the end of the tier? Which quest would you like? Gonna be another rampage. Hmm. Is this... Is this a real boss fight against Wind Serpent? Hmm. I'm wondering if this is the real boss fight, because I would want to fight that solo. But I also, with how miserable it was last time, I kind of came to the conclusion that I want to do urgent... Not urgent quests. Okay, you're fucking with my ability to speak by talking the whole time. Uh... I came to the conclusion I wanted to do rampages in a multiplayer setting because, like, it's really frustrating and overwhelming to do it alone. It's clearly not built for that. But I don't want to. Ch but I don't really want to fight the Wind Serpent in a group. I think I'm gonna stick with my previous stance. Uh, let's get my repairs and whatnot first done. I think I'm gonna stick with my previous stance, which was to uh, do this in multiplayer because it's it's a it's a rampage. And it's... Rampage is not fun to play alone. It's really frustrating. Because there's too much stuff going on and you can't, like, interact with any of the environmental stuff or build things or do much because there's this, like, wacky, ridiculous villain just destroying everything. It really trips me up how much the Gathering Hub's Palico chef looks like my Palico from Monster Hunter World. <laughs> Maybe that's the headcanon. Where they went on to go after that. But why is he done with... But why is he done with... 
My dude. Special quest has come in for you. These are the available quests. See you later then. Get me in on there. Bomb bomb. Yeah, it was really frustrating having Apex Bear Boy just beat through entire rooms before I could even start installing anything in them. And it was just like, what the fuck? He defeats the wall in like two hits. <laughs> I can't multitask fighting him and setting up stuff around the base. Just deeply frustrating. So let's play with friends. But now I feel a little awkward about micromanaging this other guy's world. Everyone's grouping up. So it begins. I believe in you. I'm here for you. How does he have so many people? I can't install any more auto turrets. Wait, is he- oh, I think he's running around reinstalling more and more and not realizing that the ones he already did are getting reset now. I don't think this guy understands how this works. Okay, it's fine. Oh, that's a lot of bears. Hoots. Get out of here. Get away from me. I gotta deal with the fact that this guy... There we go. We don't want this guy to get through to the gate. This, I feel like he's the priority. Either guys are attacking us, which is bad, but this guy will try to take out the entire thing. This is so many enemies at once. I think you try to hit the hit them in the head with the crack shot. No. Did, did he already take the gate out? It's actually hard to see because the the map in the bottom corner is so zoomed in, you can't even see the gate over there to see if it's up. I think that was it going down. My dog looks like some sort of some sort of absurd absurd Zord. I can't get over that. Yeah, I could be wrong, but I think that guy didn't understand there's a limited number of things he could play, so I think he like kept kept placing more and more auto turrets until he literally was just deleting the ones from earlier. End via sub assignment. I don't know what that means. It popped up again. I think that popped up last time and I didn't understand what it meant that time either. He's dead. A kind of cannon all the way back there? Yeah. Great Izuchi. Oh, there he is. Eh. Oh, you're not the Izuchi. You're something. Else. You're the. You're the weird... Okay. There's the Izuchi. Yeah, that's the great Izuchi. Did the bear just do a front flip over the wall? Did I imagine that? Oop. He's breaking my shit. 
I'll show you breaking my shit. This one's all for you. Oh, that was a lot of numbers. The Dragonator's unlocked. Right up his butt. That may have not been my best. I thought I would stun it, but I guess it didn't because it's a super boss or something. It doesn't work that way. What the fuck? I, I was evading that whole time. Why can't I escape that, that combo? Okay, he's down. It doesn't matter. That wire bug. There's so many bears. It's really overwhelming. <laughs> There's some numbers. First horde repelled. No, not that. Putting a bomb back there. He just keeps placing more of them, doesn't he? At least place ones that aren't already placed. He keeps overriding it. He, like, can't stop. Let me down. To happen again, it just keeps happening. That's the host, right? The guy with three symbols. I don't think he gets it. Seems a lot like he can't stop. Overriding them over and over again. Or is the number it's giving incorrect? Looking great. This is what I've been waiting for. Did that override one of the other ones or is it staying up? It's staying up. Okay. Let's get going. I was confused. <laughs> I'm here to mess you up, boy. There's the Basarios. Sorry, not Basarios. <laughs> okay, come back here. Ah, uh, they're just gonna run. This is like a really small Ra Ra Raytheon, right? Like a really small one. You're all electricity-like. I don't like that. It's 
Stop. Stop. That's not doing much damage, is it? Is it going down? Okay, good. But there's another one. That's bad. The counter signals flares powering you up. That's what the signal flare is supposed to do? Is that why I did so, that's why I did so much damage earlier? Why would a signal flare do that? I've never really understood that. There's some numbers though, geez. Six hundred Not if it misses, which it did. Inflict an elemental blight. Not really there yet. Nine out of twenty. That's a that's a puke puke. Oop. Oh, Bishotin's here. Numbers. Oh my god, those numbers. Everything's doing like six or seven times as much damage as it's supposed to. The screen is just covered in noise. I mean, this is more engaging than what they had the last game for sieges, but it's still really weird and silly. Was it their boss? Nope, he's down. Puke Puke's still up because most of us can't hit him. <laughs> That was really rude. Didn't like that. Hello, sir. Nah. God damn it. Yeah. Yeah, I dodged it. That's good. Whoa! That's this supposed to be a jump attack, not a, a dodge dive, but okay. Boom! Over a thousand damage. Almost two thousand damage. He's dead. Boop. Any of these artillery people take out the goddamn flying enemy? Okay, we won. Screen's covered in noise now. Now's my chance. I don't think anyone ever does the hold to get ready button. They seem to just go. This should be a good spot for the artillery, because there's gonna be people like right in here. He's immediately overrode it with his God damn it. <laughs> Alright. Looking great. Well then I'll use my own goddamn cannon then. How do you feel about that, buddy? I can't get over how ridiculous my dog looks. What are you? What are you? Remember when I gave you like a really grounded, uh, like, coat pattern and everything? Now he's fucking bizarre. <laughs> and he's flashing red and he's covered in crystals. I think you pretty much end up just waiting for the entire time limit.
Okay, three of us are literally just sitting in turrets. I think all four of us are just sitting in turrets, but no one's hitting the continue button. Whatever. <laughs> We're almost done. They just wait for the full timer to run out. Hey, buddy. Yep, got him. Ow, by the way. That's a close range attack, isn't it? Defeated him. I gotta get these guys off the walls. Oh, yeah. Shouldn't have spent those silk binds yet. They'll be back though. Okay, we're doing okay. Zinogre, he's also dead. That was quick. If this does turn out to be my only fight against Wind Serpent, then I guess maybe it's just like... Maybe it just doesn't matter? Maybe it's like the Zora Magdaros, where you just never really get a real boss fight against it. Because it's more of a force of nature. Oh god! Here he comes. Descending from the heavens, the fuck you is on. The fuck you on. Famous dinosaur. God, will Silkbinds even work against you? Man, that's a fast reload on the quick shots. Jeez. It's just instantly destroyed. So these boss fights are just silly, right? <laughs> I don't know where that goes, actually. Yeah, they set up this whole siege system just to... Basically just to establish how much of a badass the boss fight is when said boss fight instantly defeats you. Look at him! Sitting there upside down. Ah, did I miss? What's that gonna be? Not good. Nope. Nope, he fell over. Oh, there's the numbers. That was a big damage spike from the, the counter signal. Now that now we're trash again. Is he about to run inside the base? Or is he still gonna fight out here? Oop, that looked bad. A sky scythe. Where is he? Oh he's in. Okay. Shit. Oh my god. That seems like a lot of damage. Hope someone went down. I'm focusing purely on just raw consistency of damage and hoping that that's good. Oh god. Still not defeated. Just gotta get back up. Up 
All right. That so I guess whenever that signal happens, you're supposed to fight yourself. This should be good numbers if it hits. It did. Ah! I think it hit. I couldn't see the numbers because I was flying. Wow, that's a new one. I don't think that one's quite happened before to me. That's quite, wow, this counter signal's gonna be up for like 10 minutes? What the fuck? Look at that time limit. It's like infinite duration. Now. Yeah. Fuck them up, boys! Somebody stop them! What a weird extended, like, like, pelican mouth. Whoa, that looked dangerous. Good. Yeah, what? Staying on the ground is supposed to make you invincible so that you don't get hit by the next thing. I specifically stayed on the ground. So this is one of the hunter so this is one of the uh, monster hunter themes that is series wise. He's destroying all of the things. Now. I'm trying to, s I want to set off my big attack, but I want to make sure he's going to hit by it. It's hard to say. Look out. Ah. Okay, well, he's rearing up to fight the big thing. Hope I can aim that high. Yep. These are cartoonishly high numbers. It's like an endless slap fight. <laughs> like, the counter signals was like, yeah, I'll be up for 500 seconds. I'm like, you, you what? That's an eternity. It's like, yep, still going, by the way. We're not done with that. It's really funny watching him look at me upside down. Hey! And then he retreats undefeated. So maybe there still is a real boss fight coming. All these chunks to carve up. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> Nothing personal, kid. Let's go. Oh, what about you? Nope. That one's already gone. Doggy. So let's see, is this the ending? Is the rest of the ranks just post-game?
It caught me off guard. How did it go? <laughs> ah, took care of it, did ya? Good work. Very good work, Hunter. You weren't looking? Hinoa. <laughs> I can no longer sense its presence. Ibushi must have flown off somewhere distant. I want to say this is the end of the rampage, but something's still bothering me. We still don't know why Ibushi showed up. All we know is that it's looking for its queen. That mystery remains to be solved. Huh? You know, Minoto, tell everyone in the village that we're not out of the clear yet. Understood, Elder Fugan. That looks so absurd. Rank S. Bunch of dudes were here. Not enough elemental blight, or stunning, or repelling. But ass anyway. 24 minutes. I wonder how sparse my, uh... Beast gem. I wonder how sparse my commentary was because it was just like... I'm just kind of like poking away at this dude and it's not... It's not that much to talk about. Like a 25 minute thing where you're just kind of spamming projectiles into some monsters or... Kind of just comboing vaguely at certain dudes. Because it's just like, I don't know, there's just like 50 enemies in the screen. Something's going on. It's got, just got to keep putting numbers out to help the team. <laughs> you have done well, Jorit. The Swen Sharpen has been repelled. I thought the rampage would simmer down, but something's not right. We're still trying to figure out why Ibushi has appeared. And now there's the question of his queen that Hinoa spoke of. While the guild gathers more information, please continue to accept six-star quests. There's enough left to keep you busy. I was really caught off guard by, like, this tier. I didn't even finish the requirement for the tier, and that happened. Like, like that was the big goal. <laughs> it is really just the barest skeleton of cutscenes, where it's like, this cutscene establishes that Magnamalo's here. Oh my god. And also that your two child friends don't have a strong sense of where they belong in society. Then you fight Magna Mala, it's like, this cutscene establishes that you beat Magna Mala, and also that those two people have found their place. <laughs> this cutscene establishes that there's, there, there's Wind Serpent Ibushi, and this person feels their presence and it causes them pain. It's like, one dozen hours later, the next cutscene is like, ah, you beat Ibushi, and it's better now. <laughs> That's that's the that's the cutscenes. It's like introduces problem, beat like two or three entire star ranks tiers of the game, and then the reward is ah, it's beaten. You did it. You can edit the colors in great depth in hue, saturation, and contrast tools. Okay. Is this more than before? <clears throat> Here's the problem, my current gear. I have to click on this first. So even if you add contrast and whatnot, it's like I... This gear has so little color customization that only a relatively small, small part could be changed, and you can't change the other layers either. Like, it looks like there's a second pigment slot, but I don't think I can touch it. I think that just means that there's other gear that actually does have two pigment slots. This one's mostly un unalterable. So I'm just kind of resigned to what it looks like. Enough of that. What 
would you like to do? You did it. You freed my sister fr from her resonance with that horrid creature. I'm selfish. I apologize. The rampage is still very much a threat, but all I can think about is my sister. I cannot thank you enough. There are no new quests at the moment. If you wish to increase your HR further, please continue with six star. Good to go for now. Let's see here. How are you doing? I'm trying to remember. Do I have a ramped up weapon? Rampage weapon pigment. Okay. Rampage skills. I have, a, I have affinity boost three. The alternative is defense boost three and master rider. Pretty sure I already have Master Rider, so it's just not useful. I guess I'll just stick with Affinity 3. Yep, we're fine to go there. A dango a day from the Puke Puke Sack. Medical dango. Thanks so. Thanks so, so much for the materials. I knew I asked the right person. This pharmaceutical stuff is so hard, even if someone reads it to me, my head still st uh, ends up spinning. But I'll keep at it, so I can help everyone in the village stay healthy. And after a little studying, I tweaked the ingredients. The result came out so well, I had to put them on the menu. They're good for you and tasty, so make sure you try some next time. Analeptic Dango. I assume I can't look at it right now because I already ate a minute ago. I believe so. Play with bamboo toy. Let's see how far it goes. What are you doing? Oh, I'm like spinning it. Wow. I'm a child. <laughs> oh. See you guys next time where we see how much further the story goes.